Hey y'all, so there's only a couple more of these videos left before the 30 that I said I was going to do are all done. I'm sure you guys have enjoyed them as much as I have. <laughs> I know some of them have not been that exciting, but I mean, when you have to do a video every single day, sometimes the you know, you just, it's hard to find something interesting to talk about, um, which sounds kind of, sounds like I really don't think that much. It sounds like there's not much going on upstairs, uh, but you know, you should try it sometime. Try to make a bunch of videos every day, and uh, it's funny. You end up, it's kind of like getting writer's block. You just draw a blank, and then after you make the video, you're like, wow, I should have definitely made it about this, or you'll have like 10 ideas that'll pop into your head. But when you sit down in front of a camera, it's like, I don't know what to talk about. It's kind of funny how that works. But there's uh, there's something going on right now uh, in San Diego. I was asked about the whole Simon Cowell thing, because um, apparently there's something going on with he and his best friend's wife who's pregnant with his kid and you know people were like what do you think about all that well to me because there's there are kids involved you know it's not like you know it's not just a silly situation somebody doing something stupid um you know it, there's kids involved and it's not just the the kid you know that, that Simon Cowell and his i guess girlfriend are having but Apparently she are, still has a kid. She has a kid with her current husband who they're getting divorced. I don't know. But there's kids involved. And to me, my thought is, I just, my only concern is the kids. I hope that, that they are able to come through this as um, unjaded and, and messed up as possible. I can't imagine being under that kind of scrutiny. I guess it's kind of like um, being the royal baby. That kid's got no chance of having a regular life. Imagine having Simon Cowell as a dad. I don't know. I And I hope he'd be a fantastic father. I've got no reason to think he wouldn't be. I just have no idea. And I just imagine it'd be a lot of scrutiny. So that's my thought on it. I hope the kids are okay. And I hope that for their sakes, we as just people in general can leave them alone long enough for them to figure this out amongst themselves. This is a pretty serious situation that the people involved need to figure out. And so I just hope that they're able to do that and that the kids are okay. I mean, that's that's my thought. That's my take on it. Um, I was thinking about this yesterday, or two days ago in San Diego as well. Um, this whole, the business side of this industry gets really, really old, really, really fast. I mean, I know that it's a business and I've accepted that and that's, that's fine. It is what it is. But, I mean, if it were just me, I'd have released this album that I've been working on. I'd have released it a long time ago. It'd have been out already and, you know, it would have been awesome. But because it's a business and you got to deal with, you know, the, the ins and outs of all that, it's taking longer. But we're making a lot of progress that I'm very, very excited about. Um, had a lot of really good phone calls the last few weeks. And, you know, the next couple of days, hopefully next couple of days, couple of weeks, I'll have a kind of more definite date on when we'll be releasing a single, um, some shows that we're working on finalizing. So that's all very exciting. But man, this business side of it just gets so old sometimes. <laughs> and I just want to say, I'm done. Um, but that's what you have a manager for. And I've got a, a, a great manager at the moment. And that's helpful. So, but there's good news. There's good news. And that is that the music is it's coming. It is. Yeah, there's finally kind of a light at the end of the tunnel. I just don't have a date on when that light's going to be here, but I'll, I'll keep you posted. Anyway, that's it for today, and uh, I will see you all tomorrow.